Hey, what's up guys? It is Saints fan and welcome back to another GTA 5 video. Today, we're going to be going more on what we touched on yesterday in that video, talking about the potential low life or low rider DLC. Basically, if you didn't watch that video, Fun MW2, we found some code that was recently added with Ill-Gotten Games Part 2, which basically translated, I guess, into the code word low. And he also found a bunch of vehicle codes, which I'll get into here in a second. There's actually 12 to be more precise, but the word we got was low and the first thought for me at least was low life because i've talked about this in the past i think it'd be a really interesting dlc however some other people sort of thought it could be a low rider dlc and the cars that i'll go ahead and show up on screen here in a second they kind of fit that theme so whether it's going to be called low life low rider or something else i, I think there's sort of a theme going on here that it is going to be a bunch of low rider cars bunch of cheap stuff that are for people who do not have a ton of money. So just going through the complete list of cars, the new vehicle codes. So we have the Faction 2, the Faction 3, the Moonbeam 2, the Primo 2, the Saber GT 2, the Virgo 2, the Virgo 3, the Chino 2, the Clean Voodoo, the Buccaneer 2, the Tornado 5, and the Slam Van 3. So obviously that is a ton of cars if these are going to be added in the next DLC. That's insane. We definitely need a fourth garage. And if they don't do that, which they'd be really stupid to do, then something is wrong over there at Rockstar. But I have faith that they will give us a fourth garage, if not a completely new garage, maybe with 20 cars. I don't know. That'd be, that'd be really nice. But getting back on topic here. So we have all of these names. Now, some of them, as you can tell, the Virgo, the Chino, some of these are already in the game, especially like the Primo. That was one that was already in the game, the Tornado. That's the fifth version of them. So these cars, if they are in the game, they're most likely going to be different versions of them. For example, the last one, the Slam Van 3, this one could be the van variant, which we've seen in the heist uh, missions, but without the lost MC decals. Maybe they'll put that in because I think a lot of people like that when it was in the game. So that, that's a possible thing. Another new one, actually, the Faction. I showed you guys a picture, but there's two different versions. So maybe one is just the regular version, and the second one could be the version that is up on screen right now with the like the convertible top sort of just an idea and maybe one of the virgos could be a four-door car instead of a a two-door car maybe that's that's one of the i don't know extra versions of it another really really interesting thought and this this is getting into a little bit of a speculation here and i know some of you guys don't really like that but i think it's fun sometimes and the one bit of speculation that i just want to throw out there if this was going to be a low rider DLC or a low life DLC, and it's sort of based around, uh, I guess, gang cars, maybe that's even a theme they put in there. How awesome would it be if all of these 12 cars, because they are, they're not really new. I mean, some of them are, but most of them are the same ones. So how could Rockstar sell cars that were already in the game, but just changed a little bit? The answer to that would be hydraulics. How amazing would it be if these 12 cars had hydraulics and look i know there's gonna be some people well if they're gonna do hydraulics why not just put it into the custom shop so any car could get it like we all know rocks are they they want to get the money they want to sell stuff so i think that would be a way for them to push these cars to for people to buy them because hydraulics have been something that people have requested for a long time you guys can obviously let me know your thoughts in the comment section would you like hydraulics would that be more appealing for these cars since they are or since they do have the same names and they're more than likely going to be similar to the ones that are already in the game? Because for me personally, I think maybe not all of them, but I would definitely go out and buy a few, especially if there was a fourth garage and I had more room. That would be huge, like especially the clean voodoo that that would be amazing with hydraulics. The one thing I actually do want to mention before I end this video is do keep in mind that like the the names right here these are not going to be the names or they're not guaranteed to be the names in the next dlc for example i think somebody told me that the sterling gt in game code it's actually called the felzer 3 so just just take it you know with a grain of salt but 12 new cars potentially maybe with hydraulics i mean maybe we're wishing a little bit too much there I think that would be really, really awesome. You guys let me know in the comment section, though. Again, drop a like in the video if you did enjoy it. Subscribe for more awesome GTA content. Hope you guys enjoyed, though. As always, see you in the next one. I'm out. Peace.